Mm, go ahead. Oh, nice. Just lovely. All right, so we're back at the beach. I told you I'd be back. Uh, me and Stella this time. I'm here just for a little bit. I, we already got a ton of driftwood from last time. I just want to get a few more pieces for my buddy. The spider wood, you know, he's requesting that. Um, so it's no issue. I really want to make sure he's happy with the driftwood he gets. Um, but look it. I already got a trunk full of awesome driftwood. We're gonna take the dog, we're gonna go for a little walk. It's kind of windy, a little cool, but that's a-okay. Cause we're on the beach. So let's go, let's see if we can find some spider wood for my buddy. Wrap it up and let's go. Now who the heck comes and dumps all their damn garbage on the beach? Like, who does that? Beautiful beach. What's wrong with people, eh? Yeah, <laughs> I, I was gonna bring my drone, but last night, you know, you control the drone through your phone. Last night, lay in bed, I'm pretty tired. Plug my uh, phone in to charge, fall asleep. Wake up this morning, phone didn't charge at all, it's dead. I look, the charger wasn't plugged into the wall. So I couldn't bring my uh, drone today. But hey, I got this camera. Might consider taking that home with me. Bring it out here to the beach. <laughs> As you can see, there is like no shortage of wood to sift through. I just found this piece. I gotta clean some of this dried up seaweed off. But this is a cool looking little piece of drift here. Looks like antler horns or something. I'm gonna leave this one here. I'm gonna leave them here. Put them out a little more and get them on the way back. Here's something I see all the time, all the time on the beach here. Big old mounds of rope. I'm assuming they came off the fishing and lobster trawlers and all that. But sometimes they are actually really cool and uh, you can take them home. Maybe not this one, but Sometimes they're really colorful and, and the ropes, the variety, man. I've seen purples, pinks, blues, locker greens, orange, everything. So uh, yeah, it's kind of neat, little pile of rope. Here's a big giant tree stump and a buoy. All right, I found a piece of kind of what my buddy was looking for, something like this, spidery, but this piece is too big. So I found this cool, piece of uh, like seaweed. I, I honestly don't know what it's called. I think it might be Irish moss, but it's dried up. And these make awesome little decoration things for crafts or, or you put in your house and they just, I don't know, they're just cool. So I'm gonna keep this one. This is actually a big one and it's in good shape. Another real cool piece here. I'm not sure if it's as spidery as my buddy's looking for, but I'm gonna keep it. and. Show it to him, and if he wants it, I'll send it. Tire. Oh, hello! What you doing? I'm not going over that wall. Ready? Right here. Right here. <laughs> Some more rope. See, there's a real cool purple and yellow piece of rope mixed in. It's kind of fucking stuck in there though. I don't think I'm gonna get that one out, unfortunately, because it's actually a very beautiful piece of rope. You, you, you get back here with that. You get back here. Not my buoy. Not my buoy. You. Hey, I found the trans flag rope. There's a duck washed up on the shore here. I don't know what's going on with it. I think it's in here to stay. Aww. Poor little thing. Ah, uh -uh. stay. You okay, little bird? Oh, something's wrong with the bird. Oh, it's hurt. Aww. That actually breaks my heart. 
Oh, it's okay. I think it's dying. Unfortunately. Fuck, that is so sad. No, no, you don't want to drown in the water. No, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Oh, it's dying. I don't think it's going to live much longer. I think it's passing. I don't know if it hurt itself or what happened. Let the bird be. It's okay, bird. It's okay. Ah! Fuck! Oh. Nope. I have to let it. I have to leave it. It's going to do its thing. Oh. I think it's dying. Well, that was really sad. I'm walking back. I tried to end the video. And I see this bird in the water right on the beach. It wasn't moving, so I knew something was up. And I'm pretty sure I just witnessed it. Stella, let's go. Pretty sure I just witnessed it breathe its last breath. I don't know, maybe an eagle will get it or it'll get washed back into the ocean and the fish will eat it. Of course, you know, life, cycle of life will continue. It will be recycled into the earth, but man, that's sad. I love animals and birds and everything. I don't like seeing them die like that and live its last breath there. All right, folks, I'm back. So I found a little bit. I found this is kind of what my buddy's looking for. There's one little piece. I found this piece too, which is a little bit bigger, but it's got that spidery look. And last but not least, a tiny, just really worn out, awesome driftwood y looking driftwood piece of driftwood. So, anyways, I walked up and down this beach. I didn't find as much spider wood as I wanted to. So, I got a few pieces here. Um, yeah, I think that's it, man. I got a trunk full of driftwood. I'm going to send them some stuff. I'm sure he'll be happy. I'm sure he can make use out of whatever I send them. So, yeah, like I was saying, I think I'm going to end the video. Um, it's been a lot of fun, you know? A couple days out here, scouring the beach for some wood, and uh, you know, just hanging out with the dog. And yeah, it's been good. So anyways, folks, I'll uh, gonna sign off here. But yeah, if you need some driftwood, you're working on a terrarium, aquarium, vivarium, mammarium, gonna bury them if you get scared with them. But anyways, yeah. If you need any driftwood or whatever, give me a shout, message me, I'll hook you up. But anyways, folks, that's Jerky Jones. Another YouTube video at the beach with the pooper. She's out there somewhere. And uh, that's all I got for you. Have a great day and peace out. Now I got even more driftwood. I don't know what I'm going to do with all this. <laughs>